Have you ever named a compound like this before? Let's start with our longest carbon chain, which is four carbons, one, two, three, four, making this a but. Now, this functional group here, this C double bond O connected to a nitrogen, that is an amide, which gives us the ending anamide. We don't need to number this because by definition, this now has to be carbon number one in the same way with carboxylic acids, we don't number that oic acid group. Now we have these two methyl groups, these one carbon branches sticking off of this nitrogen. Now, because we've got those two methyl groups, this makes this dimethyl butanamide. And because those methyl groups are attached to the nitrogen, to position them, we don't give them a number. Instead, we position them with the letter N. So this will be N, N, dimethyl butanamide. Did you learn something new? Follow me for more chemistry content like this.